Hollywood apparently decided that what the audience wanted this Christmas holiday was to reverse sex roles. First, Arnold Schwarzenegger takes on the traditional female role of childbearing in Junior. Now Demi Moore plays the sexual harasser in Disclosure. When a man plays a woman, it's a comedy. But when a woman takes on a male role, it becomes a scary film. Jill Brooke examines why. There's a line for the 8 a.m. meeting tomorrow if there's... Get down to business. It's a seductive premise. Instead of the man harassing the woman, in Disclosure, Demi Moore is the abusive boss. Considering that over 90 percent of all sexual harassment cases are filed against men, would Disclosure have sparked such media attention if the man was the aggressor? Most experts say no. There aren't very many women who are, you know, harassing men in the way that they've been, they've been treated, and this is a very, very small problem. Like many other movies, Disclosure uses role reversals as a calculated plot device. The filmmaker can create a buzz by addressing an issue in an unexpected way. You should try being a woman sometime. It's a nightmare. Another example is Junior. Tough guy Arnold Schwarzenegger gives birth to his feminine side by becoming pregnant. But what distinguishes these movies is how the audience sizes up these two types of gender bending. When a man plays a woman, it generates laughs. Junior, like Tootsie and Mrs. Doubtfire, are comedies. It makes a man look vulnerable, but it also uh, women enjoy it because they feel empathized with. But Disclosure is not a comedy, nor is Oleana, where a professor's helpfulness with a student is misinterpreted and becomes a cautionary tale for men about gender politics. Oh, don't tell me you're scared of me. These movies feed into the fears of men in dealing with women asserting power. According to Michael Douglas, men are having difficulties adjusting to women's ascension in the workplace and deciphering what is expected of them. I think guys are really lost as to what their roles are. They're getting very mixed signals from women. Yes, the white male privilege is disintegrating in the society and they're striking out against powerful women and the success that we've made. Yet many say that these role reversals are a positive force because they are catalysts for heated discussions on gender issues. In the role reversal that it will hopefully, hopefully stimulate some greater insight or awareness or hopefully in the best of all worlds uh, some solution for change. Or at the very least, further discussion. Jill Brooke, CNN Entertainment News, New York.